Alcoa Corporation is turning up the heat on the Stanley County Commissioners so it can get control of the Yadkin River for the next 50 years to generate hydroelectricity and earn millions. The revenue for the project would be about $44 million a year. Here's what the Concord Tribune wrote about Alcoa's deal. Some offers are hard to refuse, others are hard to believe. Alcoa's promise to create hundreds of jobs is clearly in the latter category. The Tribune isn't buying Alcoa's promise to pay Stanley County millions either, because Alcoa refused to post a bond to guarantee the payments. The Tribune wrote, Alcoa's promise is like Wimpy in the Popeye comic strip, saying, I'll gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. The Stanley County commissioners were even blunter. They said Alcoa's promise isn't worth the paper it's written on. Governor Perdue has also opposed Alcoa controlling the Yadkin. We're losing everything, including control of one of our premier resources, and we are gaining nothing. And that doesn't make good economic or political sense. Alcoa is turning up the heat to get control of the Yadkin hydroelectricity. Alcoa's deal is not a fair deal for Stanley County or North Carolina, but it's a great deal for Alcoa.